to the family channel. Hello everyone and welcome to the baking night on the family league. Tonight we're going to show you how to make a grass block Minecraft cake. Woo! What the ingredients? Uh, we need chocolate cake mixer, uh, water, oil and three eggs. Awesome, so that's just for the base? Yeah, so that's for the base, yeah. You need to... So you need a man around the house, you know? Yeah. Okay, so put it in here. One. Okay. Next, add your eggs, your oil, and then your water. One goes in. Gonna go through. Add your water. The oil. It's, it's just so easy. And the next bit's my personal fibre. You put it in the mixer. You put it in the mixer, yeah. Once your cake mixture's sitting looking all delicious and you just want to stick your face in it and destroy it, then that means it's ready. <laughs> then you pick up your three cake pans. Yep, I said three because we need to make three of them. We need to put them on top to look like a block. Exactly. Yeah. That's why we used three packets of cake mixture, three eggs and ingredients times three basically. You just put something like that and this one. Delicious, doesn't it? Yeah, I really just I yeah. do want to stick my face right into that. Make sure you like move it around so the mixture is sitting straight at the bottom, so there's no in the middle like a big lamp, like a wee mountain. So it's going to be nice and even. Yeah, so they can sit nicely on top of each other. Yeah, like that. Put the oven on for I put it for 180 or yeah, 180 or 200. For 25 minutes! Oh, you just switched it off. <laughs> Once your cake is in the oven and you have to wait for 25 minutes, you can make yourself useful and just make the grass for the block. So you would need maybe two bags of uh, uh, coconut flakes and uh, green food coloring. Mmm, there's yeah. your grass. Yeah, put all the coconut in the bowl and then keep dropping the food coloring and keep mixing and mixing it until it looks like this. And that's you. You've got your ready to roll icing. This stuff was a wee bit difficult to get. We had to buy it in hobby craft. And we had to get the white, the yellow one as well because it's for the flower that we be doing on yeah. the floor. It's a wee bit tough just now, so what I would recommend first is put, put it in the microwave for, I don't know, 5 seconds, 20 seconds, something like that. Just play it by ear. You don't want it to get too soft and squidgy. You're going to want to get some Oreo cookies and digestive biscuits, okay? Now what you're going to do with them is you're going to put them in the blender, stick them in your blender and just spin that bad boy until they turn into powder. Yeah, make sure you put a digestive or two or three digestive biscuits in there as well. To get that lovely dirty texture. Yeah. Let's just roll the icing because it's nice and soft just now. Oh, this is a hard work, man. <laughs> right, okay, so once you've got your grass, or your icing, sorry, uh, rolled out nice and flat, that's when this comes into action. So basically what this is, is baking paper, and Lacra got the tin for the cakes, sat it on top of the baking paper, and traced the shape. So it's the same size as the baking tray. And then all she done was add these little extra pixelated bits of overhanging grass onto the edge. So she only done it on one side because what we're going to do is turn it around, turn it around, turn it around when it's on the icing and cut it out on the icing. Put the baking paper on and take a knife and just shape it up with a knife like that. Let's do it. And once you've done with this side, take the paper and make sure this one is on this side and cut on this side and then this side as well and then this side. 
So you made a lovely grass on top of your block. Once your cakes are out of the oven, make sure you put the first layer of cake and put chocolate icing on the first layer. And once you put on the first layer, you keep taking every layer and you put it on top and you keep your icing on, okay? Just make sure to take a wee bit of care with your second layer of the cake and don't let it crumble like we just did. David did that, not me. Uh -huh. So now make sure you take your icing and just put everywhere, even on the sides. Make sure you put all your icing. Mmm, that looks yummy. Oh, yeah. Now it's time to get down dirty with your dirt. Get your dirt mixture, right? And just get it on there. Just get some of that. Oh, it's looking like a big block of dirt there. Next is uh, if you rolled your icing. Uh, the grass. He goes, can you help me here a little bit, mister? Help. Whoa, look at that. Make sure it's all put nice and smoothly down. Right, so once your grass is all on the cake and looking all Minecrafty and blocky goody, get yourself some buttercream style icing. Couple of drops of food colouring in that bad boy and get it looking that colour. After we're going to smear it on the top, you're going to get your coconut looking grass and that's going to be used to hold the coconut grass in place. Oh. And now you can start getting that grass on top. That is looking awesome, isn't it? <laughs> it does actually. Last but not least, make yourself a little Minecraft flower using the, ro the ready rolled icing, okay? And we're just using a wee bit of food colouring here, yellow food colouring, just to try and darken up a wee bit in wee squares to give it that sort of pixelated look. That looks pretty good, doesn't it? It does, so give me a five. Yeah, knock <laughs> me down. Yeah, so, there you have it. A fantastic Minecraft grass block cake. So if you like to try the recipe, we will leave the uh, ingredients down below and you can try on and let us know how you went with your cake. Thanks a lot for watching everybody. Make sure to try it yourselves and let us know how you got on and we'll see you next time. Cheerio!